and welcome to another support video from Instrument Choice. In this video, we will show you how to overcome three common error messages on the EasyLog USB software. The following message may appear when your USB data logger is not communicating properly with the software. These are if your USB data logger is plugged in, if the battery is okay, or if the USB driver has been installed. Let's go into each of these three issues and how to fix them. While this one might seem like the most obvious, it's always important to check that the USB is inserted correctly. It's always quite helpful to check more than one port as well if you're receiving this message. For checking the battery, data loggers with LCD screens are quite simple to check. Press the button to turn on the display. Loggers without screens can be a little bit more difficult. One way to look is you can open up the case, take out and reinsert the battery. This will then display a red, orange, thin green light to show that the battery has power. If you do happen to have a multimeter available, you can always use that to check the battery too. Note that removing the battery will stop any logging. If it does appear to be a battery issue and you have a spare, change the battery and plug the USB in. This is the most common cause and the simplest fix. The battery life of the data logger will vary depending on logging frequency, storage and use. If you're unsure of how to change the battery, there's a link in the description on how to change the battery on the EL USB one. The third issue you may encounter will be a driver issue. To check this is the case, open your device manager. Uh, to find the device manager, simply click the start menu and use the search function to find device manager. The device manager screen should look something like this. Expand the section Universal Serial Bus Controllers by clicking the arrow on the left hand side. If the logger appears and is named EasyLog USB device, that means the driver is installed correctly. If it was the case that the driver had not been installed correctly, it will appear under other devices and the USB data logger would be called USB API or even unknown device. If this is the case, follow our comprehensive guide that we have linked below to get your driver installed correctly. We hope that you have found this video helpful. As always, you can contact one of our scientists if you need any further help. Thanks for watching.